I'm basic. I like to live, laugh, and love. <laughs> no. Gotta start somewhere. That's uh, the hardest part. Start. The cankles holding up. <laughs> <laughs> Got the soup ready. Yeah. What is that? Some bread, homemade bread. Um, I think it's just like flour, starch, and oil. Vegetable oil. It's good for you. Three ingredients. Huh? <laughs> that's that's the money maker. Uh, session last night. Uh, coaching went even great because I coached before I go into session. It was a really relaxed uh, day. Uh, coaching the kids, we learned a lot, and uh, it definitely had me pretty excited. I was focusing on that one trick, uh, pretty much all, all throughout coaching as well. Uh, Gumby court. Very scurry, scurry trick, but it's not going to be scurry today. Just because it was one of those tricks that's haunted me for, for so long, like eluded me. Every time I get up to the batter's box, it'd just be like, strike. So last night we. Uh, we swung for the fences and it was definitely, a, it worked out a lot. Oh, yo, one shot. <gasps> I did it. You found her. Yes. <laughs> I did it. Let me see it now. What you making here? <laughs> Hello, Jello. <laughs> uh, I've been tricking for three years, since 2016, three years now. It's the, the weird thing about it for me. And the, also the thing I love the most is you don't have to have a background. It's Simple body movements. I mean, just just simple jumping, kicking, stuff. I believe we, sh you know, all can do. Uh, all right, where she will go and wait till her arrival of eight hours. Eight, eight hours. Eight hours. Eight hours. Did I just spill some? Do you, do, you, do, you have, do you have any uh, saran wrap? Huh? Do you have any saran wrap? You're supposed to just no. wrap over the top of it. No, you can't put anything over top yes, of it. Yes, you can. No, if you put something over top of it, that heat that's in there will not be able to go anywhere, so it's never going to dry. <laughs> Actually, and if it's in a refrigerator, it's cool. The entire temperature is whatever you yeah, have to do. Yeah, but if you cover the top... It it's still allows heat to escape, though. It condensates on the top. Okay, and that water will actually go to the bottom, and you, then when you ever you go to eat it, it's going to have some really watery, like runny stuff that's not going to taste too good. Well, if you're worried about it, then poke some holes in the pasta. Actually, I'm not worried about it at all, so I'm just going <laughs> to leave it the way it is.
No! Yo, one shot gang! One shot gang! Fuck <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, What you working on today? I'm gonna work on a double twisting one legged backflip. Dub C, double cork, double cork screw. Um, frightening. <laughs> Woke up this morning picturing it. <laughs> so then it's gotta go. Work, work and everything just made me a little tired. But I'm gonna picture it. I'm gonna picture myself doing it, landing it, stomping it, and moving on to the next one. Oh my god. Oh man. <laughs> my mindset going in today was was a little lackluster, so I knew I was gonna have to already like, kind of really dig, but of course on the um, the one I fully sent, I fell. Oh yeah. So um, it made me take a step back and wonder, just let that doubt kind of seep in that day, or just at this practice. But that happens, and I'm okay with that because I got closer than I've ever been, and um, you know, that's the first step in, you know, really getting anywhere is getting close so that's one thing I love about tricking it's uh, it gives you that step back it gives you that reality check that you know a lot of us could benefit from sometimes I don't know but it just, it's crazy to me how some sports they can take you out of your head and you know, some sports sports can actually like yeah get you in the flow state where you, you enjoy it more you're you're obsessing over it you're creative you're pushing it and you just I still didn't land up for it. <laughs> but I'll be back.